You can update your B3 miners now and increase some hash rate to gain more profits. And another news, <laughs> GPU miners now attacking ASIC miners. A Tensority algor mining algorithm is cracked. So stay tuned. Hey, hey, hey guys, I hope you're all doing good and uh, you're back in Mining Hardware channel. This is me, your host Guntis, and good to see you back again uh, for a new video. And uh, yeah, um, just want to get out a quick update. Um, Unminer B3, there's been a software update and uh, miners are hashing about 20-30% faster. So I didn't want you to lose out some mining profits and wanted to get out this video as fast as I can. Um, so yeah, yesterday Bitmain come, uh, came out with the uh, um, software update for the Unminer uh, B3, which mines uh, Bytum. And uh, yeah, to update the miner, it's it's quite simple as as any of the the Bitmain uh, miners. I will I'll leave the link in the description where to download these image files. So you just go and download the image files. Then you need to log into your miner um, as usually you do to through the miner IP address. Uh, then click on a systems tab and then choose a, a tab. Uh, to upgrade but before you upgrade the miner uh, please uh, just in case if something goes wrong uh, download the backup uh, file so download you know just in case if something happens some you know do you get the power disconnected at, at the time you're upgrading and something stucks or or it doesn't work out for you just to be safe that you can downgrade your uh, uh, minor uh, files that you do, that way you don't lose all the mining profits um, So yeah, after you have uh, download backed up your miner first you need to upload the file uh, which does fix the Pan uh, speed issue. There was an issue on the Unminer uh, B3 panel uh, Where they were showing fan speed at the zero all the time but actually the fans uh, was working this was only a bug but yeah after updating this file so just putting the file in the box and click upgrade it will take a few minutes and after the, the upgrade this issue should be fixed and you should see your uh, fans speed um, the next thing is the most important file which is gonna bring you up your hash rate bump of your hash rate about 20 30 percent so you put that and upload and it will also take about five minutes. Um, you don't need to do anything else. If you connect to the pool, you will stay to the same pool. You don't need to put in your settings uh, in once again. Um, yeah, and this way you upgrade and uh, get increased your uh, miner. Yeah, the, 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 the mining profits has done, gone down significantly uh, from my last video for the uh, Bytum. Um, so I was getting at that time about 30 bucks a day. Now it's about 10 bucks a day for mine, which is still good. Uh, it's still profitable uh, for that price of the machine. Um, anyway, anyway, but there's a, a better things. Uh, I've seen a few guys came out in the U pool, a Chinese mining pool, and I've seen a, a, a post uh, on the Bitcoin talk from the Wask Wask coin, uh, which is another good mining channel. Um, you can go and take a look look on it. Um, yeah, I, I seen that, um, uh, um, like Bytum is on a Tensority algorithm, which is supposed to be only for ASIC chips, which produce Bitmain, uh, Sofan company, like the AI chips, uh, but, um, they say that they, they won't, you won't be able to hash with a graphics card, it's only profitable with the, these chips, but there's, a uh, pool has came out, they have, they have cracked this, uh, and, uh, they are hashing at quite good speeds, you know, for the graphics cards. Um, hashing uh, 1050 Ti's at 300 hashes per card. So that's about how much one card, it's about 150 euros somewhere, one 1050 Ti, so six cards per rig if you put, um, you will get 1800 hashes. So it's nearly twice as fast as the, the uh, uh, B3 miner, uh, but 
I'm, I'm not sure about it. I couldn't find anything about the power usage, but I assume it's not much, you know, because the, 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 the 1050 Ti's use maximum 70 watts maybe per card. Um, also, it's only a, a new, so might be some kind of, uh, might be some kind of more, uh, you know, minor upgrade that you will increase more speed in a, in a maybe time. Um, uh, you, they, they, they might be upgrading the stability of the miner and so on, so to get the more speed. Yeah, and this is possible um, also only on NVIDIA cards on the Linux at the moment, as far as I could find. Um, yeah, so Bitman has some competition. <laughs> yeah, they, somebody gonna give a, a big uh, kick in the ass for them to wake up. <laughs> yeah, maybe maybe that's the reason why they, they, they uh, put out this update to increase the uh, speed uh, for the uh, B3 miners so yeah let me know in the comments have you tried to mine the uh, Python with your graphics cards Nvidia and um, yeah did it work out well for you what's the hack trace you get what's the power usage uh, another good option to know so yeah thank you again guys for watching the video I do really appreciate all the comments and thoughts and uh, yeah, if you do have a comment, um, comment down below. If you found the value from this video, you can share with your friends also. Um, in the next video, I think I'm to uh, maybe mine Ravencoin and see the speeds and uh, how to set up to mine uh, Ravencoin because it uses a different mining al algorithm, which is called X16R, uh, which is 16 different mining algorithms in one. So yeah, stay tuned for the next video and take care, bye.